Yo, what's up everyone? Welcome to a, another mukbang. Today I have McDonald's. Got the new Mexican crispy chicken salsa. I chose the basic one. I'm here with a special guest. You already know his name, you know. Deadly ASMR. Um, follow me on Snapchat, Keegan9853. Instagram, lovely ASMS. I'm hungry, man. Yeah, I'm starving as well. What'd you get? I got a good old fish in there. I don't know, what kind of menu is this? Big That's Mac. Bad. Just a Big Mac? Mm -hmm. Doesn't look half bad, actually. It's pretty good. Not bad at all. It's fresh, it's still hot. My fries are still warm. And we're recording this off uh, the iPhone. We got uh, fried sauce. Fried sauce. God, guys, everybody asks what sauce is it? Well, you can only get it here, I think. I think you can only get it here. Maybe in Belgium as well. Don't know. But it's like a tangy mayonnaise with a <coughs> little bit of herbs in it. Really, really good. Yeah, that's the crispy chicken, man. It's about the best explanation I could give for the sauce. It's amazing. Mm. Yeah, not very big, yeah. Mm. Believe it or not, it's uh, ketchup. Ketchup just ain't the done thing, yeah. Remember it's not, when we were It's not uh, what it used to be. Yeah, it's not what it used to be. Too artificial coloring. Yeah, that scared people off with the ketchup, you know. Oh, so much sugar. Makes kids fat. <coughs> that type of thing, you know. Cheers. Mm. Ooh. Pretty good. Whoa. Well, I know where the sugar from the ketchup went. Coca Cola. Mmm. Mm. Good. Oh, give me this burger. Mmm. So, actually, mm. fun fact. Mm. Mm. We are currently. Uh, let's not say the location, obviously. Um, mm, no. We are close to Rotterdam, in that very nice river. Beautiful behind us, we're in between the trees. Can't really see it. Maybe we'll give a, a pan shot just now so you guys mm. can see the back. Beautiful, the, stunning. Let me tell you something about that. This is a, a straight road. How, how many? I'm um, up uh, like three, four hundred meters. Mm. Nah. This road's good for about straight mile, flat, straight. Now, it is really tempting, especially when you have a mm. fast car to race here, but we ain't gonna do that because. This place is notoriously known f as getting speeded and getting yeah. arrested because driving too fast in here. Yeah, not only young guys. Old guys as well. Older guys as well. They come here with their... Oops, sorry, Tommy. They come here with their fast cars. And they just gun it. But the hidden cameras... They're everywhere. <laughs> so you can't get home and still lose your license. <laughs> we, we don't even... We probably may not even know, but we, we might be recorded now because, you know, they hide stuff in the trees and... Crazy. If you don't believe me, it's, it's actually true. Make money, yeah. Our government's a money-making machine. It's like McDonald's. Yeah, crazy, man. This is actually really nice. I'll show you what it looks like. Whoa, that's the crispy chicken one. Damn. I chose just the original one because I don't like spices, as you guys know. All over my dashboard. <laughs> you knock it over, you die. <laughs> this burger's good. Hmm. Mm. Actually, the first burger I have to admit that I ever enjoyed from McDonald's. Being being really honest, you took a chicken one. That's why. Take a bite, man. The sauce combines. It's good. What sauce is it? I don't know, mm. but it's definitely not Mexican because there's not a Mexican wow. sauce that I know of. No, no, no. You could have chosen for salsa, but you said no mm. because uh, I don't like spices. It's a bit of a go when it comes to spices. I cook with hot all the time. I even make a homemade guacamole. Not salsa, guacamole, green, we know. But uh, I put uh, real chilies. I cut up two whole chilies, a little bit, a little baby jalapeno pepper, and it goes in my guacamole with the onion and the avocado and the lime. Man, does that burn. But the taste mm. of the garlic. Oh, mm. Rem remember in Thailand? Mm. When was that Thailand exactly? Yeah, two years ago. I think not now, I think. I didn't have a YouTube channel back then, no. so that's, that's more than three years ago. Because well, fun be. fact, today, I mean, at the recording, today's Friday. Yesterday, believe it or not, was a very special day. Three year anniversary of me doing YouTube. Now, I know some people are going to say, but what do you mean three years? So look, I created a YouTube account on 2000, in 2015, 12th mm -hmm. of December, but a, almost a year later, I decided to actually do something with do it. Do something with it. Yeah. So the creator date 
Well, the upload date isn't 2015, but 16. And that was yesterday. Had the most amazing positive reactions from fans. Yeah, you get you get the trolls coming by as well. But even after a couple of conversations with them back and forth, even they start out giving you the thumbs up. Mm. It's pretty cool. I've, <laughs> I've had sometimes the people say, you know, on my Snapchat, they're just angry, and then I talk, and I say to them, I know you're angry. If you want to talk about it, talk to me about it. And then they actually talk about the problems, and then I say, you see, you can just tell me if there's something wrong, man. Yeah, because how must I know if, if there's something with you and if you're cursing at me? Some people are having a, a lousy day, maybe shit, maybe a lousy, a lousy year. We don't yeah. know. So they just get on the internet, check his random video out. Maybe they've seen you before, maybe they haven't. I don't know. And they're like just ah, negativity all over you. Please stop doing this. You really suck. You know this and that. But really often, after a couple of chats or conversations, apping back and forth, you know, messages. Hey, you really realize that the people are cool, they're, just angry. They're just, they're, just cool. they're, they're people just with some with a problem. Yeah. Not, not like a bad, doesn't have doesn't have to be a bad problem. Just have, could just have a bad day. Besides which, everyone's got an opinion. Hmm. Everyone's mm. allowed to have an opinion. And an opinion might be based on facts, maybe not. Yeah, just a very yeah. Which one's angry one? person. This mm. one's mine, right? Wow. Yeah, that camera is crazy that you have. That is absolutely, that is one fine burger. I do find it way, why, why the cars right. driving and what is, can they go straight? No, they can't, right? No, they have to turn around and go back. What's the point of them driving it then? Pass the cameras. <laughs> mm. uh, oh no, it's, it's a lesson card. Mm. The same car keeps coming back, coming, coming, coming back every time. I must admit, McDonald's fries have got something about them. Mm. Too much salt in my pants. No, I love salt. No, I don't. Would be cool as if they had a spicy version. Oh, that would be awesome. Uh, the car just disappeared, I think. It's probably drove in the water. <laughs> oh, no, it's there. Oh, uh, there it is. Mmm. Mmm. It's called shit. A lot of kids are out learning how to drive, get their licenses. Very scary. Me as well, actually. <laughs> Him too. <laughs> I sometimes drive as well. When he goes for driver's ed, we stay off the roads. <laughs> I'm actually not a bad driver, man. No, not at all. I mean, I've seen other kids driving, I'm like, eh, mm. eh, yeah, you know. I ain't trying to sound cocky, but, you know, I, f I mean, I think it, it, do it does help if, you, if you've driven before on the automatic and this and that, you know, that it just, that you know what it feels like to have a steering wheel on your hand. <laughs> I think uh, stick shift, sucks mm. and by law you have to get the driver's license with a stick shift and i know a lot in america they don't drive for a stick shift no nah, what the hell for it's old ass technology which is going to disappear nonetheless i hope cause it's going to disappear look i would i mean would i i mean it's nice it's for look for me you know I have autism. Is it a, isn't it an excuse I can use or? Uh, it, I, it's it's a lot for me to do when I have a stick shift. I gotta pay attention to the road, everything, and you just you know it's just so much things to do. Yep, that little uh, that little brain just has a burnout. <laughs> it does fall off. Now, because you're busy with so many signals in your own brain, and you add the signals from the outside. I can't handle yeah, that little head. Man, sometimes it's a real mess. Hmm. Except when he's busy with his channel, then he's focused. Damn, chill. I always hungry. Mm. Me too, because I haven't eaten today. Mm. I haven't. Didn't have breakfast. <laughs> Only thing I dislike about waking up very early at seven o'clock is that just there's not really a time to to wake up relaxed, you know. Nope. I hate that. I don't know. I just don't like it. Damn, that cola's good. That's, where did you order cola? Man, I ain't never tasted something so sweet in my life. Woo! I swear to God. They got rid of the ketchup because it had too much sugar in it. I'm sure they put all the sugar from the ketchup back into the cola machine. Look, I'm being very honest. 
I used to drink uh, mm. curry. No, I'm not talking about curry spices. I'm talking about um, the sauce. The sauce, but you can just taste. And actually, with no, actually about ketchup. Ketchup. I'm not I'm sure. I'm sure I'm not the only person who's experienced this before. But every time I have ketchup, it burns my throat. It actually burns because of the amount of sugar that's in it. All the chemicals. It just burns. <laughs> oh, mm. The chicken is really good. I'll be honest with you there. Wow. Oh. My menu was killer. Mm. I got some more sauce for you if you want. Oh, we didn't order a lot. Damn, I got some fries. Okay, so I got some of these fries. <laughs> you want to talk about it about uh, Tuesday? About Tuesday? Uh, yeah, if you want, it's cool. Nothing here. No, that's cool. Can I talk about it, like? Yeah, of course. About him? No, why not? Okay, so Tuesday, we're gonna go. Me, and my dad, and my brother are gonna go to Luxembourg. Yeah, we're gonna go through uh, through in this car. We're gonna go through to Luxembourg to a place called uh, Fienden. And, um, Beautiful between the mountains. We usually go with them with the motorbikes, but this time it's uh, it's um, how can we say it? it's uh, it's a nice place, but there's one place in Vianda that's a place got bad memories. It's got bad memories, really bad memories. A very yeah. good uh, friend of ours, well of uh, of Keegan and uh, Cars, my other son, Stefan. He unfortunately was killed a few years ago in a bike accident, accidenting a corner. Mm -hmm. And that is such a major impact on, on the families. And because you know, you got to realize, man, everyone knew each other, still knows each other nowadays. Everyone lived in the same area. Yeah, we lived a couple of houses apart. Yeah, we can just walk every day. I mean, you know, the thing is, the main reason that it actually hurts me that he's not here because he was very, very young. He was a very, very humble guy. Very, he was way too he had, a, he had a heart of gold. He was really soft, man. 22 ain't no time to go. Especially if that, you know, happens. But yeah, massive impact on the families. Still to this day, I cry about it. I'm not even gonna lie, you know. I'm gonna, I'm being very honest. I cry about it because it's just... It's heavy. It's heavy. I you mean, you got kids. You got your own kids and you see... Friends of yours lose one of their kids. And that has one hell of an impact. Yeah. But you get back out there. You carry on. And make them proud. You don't let stuff break you. Oh. But so choose them. We are going to pop over. I think it's a three and a half hour drive. But this Vienna is the most beautiful, we have been there before. place you've ever seen. Yeah, yes, you've made videos uh, of Vienna yeah, before. That's, that's, that was cool. That was like, I think more than two years ago, actually. Yeah. Man, it was, it was uh, with a bike trip. When you went on the mm. bike for the first time, on the back of the motorcycle. Man, it was scary. Man, at one adventure point, we 300 actually... 300 miles down the road. At one point, we actually, actually mm. slipped a little bit. Right? Of, uh, in the corner. Yeah, but... The corners are very tight there. The corners are massively mm. tight. And with luggage on board and him on the back, and me behind, me steering. It's scary. It's pretty scary, because some of the... Some of the little twisties are real sharp. So you got to really gear down. you got to be very careful. R remember, he's on the back with all the luggage. And then hope it doesn't go over in a slow, sharp turn. But it was a lot of fun. So, Tuesday, we're going back with lots of good memories and... Bad memories. I'm gonna the more good memories and bad memories, which is I'm what it's about. I'm definitely gonna put flowers on this place. Yeah, they're already organized. We're so and I, I know some of you're gonna mm. probably wonder. You're saying all this, but are you gonna um, take a photo? I'm just gonna say out of respect, I'm, I'm not gonna be taking photos of the place where you no, go. I've been there. That's a disrespect for my opinion. And no, there's no, uh, there's no purpose. We don't no. need to do that. But we are going with uh, the three of us. So, uh, so me with my two kids. We're just gonna have a good time. We're gonna. We're going to spend the night in Vienna. We've booked the most beautiful hotel where we book every time we go. Food is awesome because I will, t I will tell you one thing. Whether it's Luxembourg, Germany, Belgium, the kitchen, <laughs> I'm telling you, they are connoisseurs in the kitchen. Mm. They know how to make food. Mm -hmm. And the beer is good too. So uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. Mm. A lot of fun. Damn, I'm full. I'm not full at all, actually. Man, that's such a little... Such a little person See. got such an appetite. <laughs> so we're finally I'm finally done with school. God damn man. For what, a couple of weeks? Two weeks? No, a week. Next week Monday I go back. Are you only free for a week? Yeah, I thought that two sucks. weeks. Hey, we're gonna grind out the videos, trust me man. Yep. I'm, I'm gonna, videos are gonna go. I'm gonna make a roleplay. 
Um, this channel's got to pop, uh, this channel, the mukbang channel's got to pop 50k, probably do that tonight. And the other channel with, uh, with the comments up and running, don't ask us how. I don't YouTube, know. what the hell are you doing again? Nobody knows. But uh, thanks. If you're not going to shut the comments down after three, four, five days, like you previously have, great. That would be highly appreciated. The reason? Don't give a rat's ass as long as the comments stay up there. We don't care. But thanks. And it's amazing to be able to comment for you, to comment to all your uh, fans on your main channel. Yeah, I like, like, don't get me wrong, I love Snapchatting and Instagramming, but YouTube has something that Snap and Instagram just doesn't have. I don't know how to quite explain it. It just doesn't have what, what, what YouTube has, you know? Yep. It's I agree. Something about it. I agree totally. Different, different, different. Yeah. So the total cost, okay, so let's, let's, let's. Uh, look, being very honest, man, I don't know what the, the prices is of, of McDonald's in, in America, but ours ain't cheap at all, man. No. <laughs> Holy crap. Um, this this was two burgers, an iced tea, a cola. Medium medium menu. Then. Medium menu and small fries. Yeah. Medium fries. Yeah. Uh, this came to, I'm going to convert it back to dollars. It came to about... 18. Nah, s s nah, maybe $18. Yeah. I don't think you guys would pay $18 for this. Nope. But that's the difference between your salaries and where you guys are. Yeah. But uh must admit we were there and mm -hmm. you guys have got the most awesome food. Although I'm gonna have to say one thing. I was really shocked at the swimming places. Everywhere I, I saw the food, I I not, didn't see one thing of salad or anything. The only actual a healthy thing was a Restaurant. chicken a chicken wrap salad in a wall that's yeah, swimming pool. Yeah, all right, but that's commercial stuff. They're not oh. going to hang around there with fresh salads. That and, were, fun fact, I, I think we actually went diving in this pool as well. I found a lot of money, man. I, I, I Everybody think, loses stuff in them tidal pools. You found an iPhone 7? No, I found an iPhone. Wow, it was, what was it back? It was an iPhone 5. Yeah. Just floating around in this waterproof <laughs> baggie. And I, I, it wasn't locked. <laughs> Got hold of the dude's... Uh, Father-in-law, yeah. he didn't know who the hell this, who, yeah. who's phoning me with this weird accent. I said I found a phone, blah 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 blah. And eventually, an hour and a half later, his son-in-law rocked up to meet me, some other kitty playground. And yeah, it's your phone. Oh, great, thanks, man. I said, yeah, no problem. And we didn't get nothing for any return. No, I just it gave him a hand. That's all I wanted. But not my phone. I actually collected over a hundred dollars just in the swimming pool in like two weeks in coins. <laughs> yeah. Everything was coins. Now this kid was walking around the pockets, jingling, jingling, full of coins every day. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> I mean, I coins mean, all over the tidal pools, everywhere you could swim, coins, 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 coins. The one thing I was quite disappointed was, especially in what, where did we shop? At? When we were in Florida, did we shop at Walmart? Walmart, big ass shop. It <laughs> even sold pellet guns, air rifles. Did they? I have no clue. Dude, they, they were did. holding it. Yeah, 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 they sold it. Oh, I shot my first gun. Uh, I think I was 11 at the time. Did I? I didn't no, you were not. I think you were 14. No, no, no I wasn't. It was longer than you think. I was. I think I was 12. You shot a Glock, right? They degraded <laughs> AR-50 rifle, so it wasn't automatic. But it was shot a, with a nine millimeter Beretta. Shot with a .22 uh, Ruger. And then a kickback. Shot real well. For the first time, man. Eh? Yeah, we put down I think a hundred dollars. And we shot out a couple of hundred rounds. It was amazing. Not too good. Doesn't work. Doesn't work like that, yeah. All mm -mm. the shit's illegal. You know, we don't even have shooting ranges here, I think. Yeah, we do, but you have to go on special courses. You have to go a hundred times a year. And if you're not psycho in the head as well. Mm. It's just a waste of time, yeah. Yeah. Damn, okay, man. Are we going to wrap this up? Shit, man. I think we should. I think you should take that and pan. Give them a give a pan around of what's going what? on here. The back outside. Mm. Oh, it's nice. That shit the big, man. This camera on the iPhone is crazy. Give the pen around at the back to the window. I don't think you can see this. I think you can. Oh, yeah. This is where Haley uh, is in the car. This, this camera on this iPhone is crazy. Okay. Now, let's wrap right. it up. So, we're going to end the video, man. <sighs> Guys, lots of love and peace. I will keep on doing this. And real soon, I'm going to make another... A song piece and more filled with Keegan and I'm gonna really keep it down to a whisper. I ain't so good with You suck with this stuff, like no joke. <laughs>
all right i'll see you next time and uh um about tuesday i'm gonna definitely i want to definitely record a video in the uh which room am i getting am i getting uh, the luxurious one i think you get no you get it you, you'll get the single because you're small and me and your brother will get the luxury room. otherwise you stay with your brother and i'll stay in the single uh, i don't care no man i want the luxurious one man i'm i'm famous <laughs> Just kidding. Alright, I'll see you next time. Uh, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Peace!